I'm Becky Newton of Weird Loners. And I'm Zach Knighton of Weird Loners. The show airs on Tuesday nights at 9.30, so watch it. I have known Becky Newton now almost a year? I think one year. About one year. One year. But I've been stalking her for eight years. <laughs> So it's I know true. it pretty well. It's true. So Zach, what was the name of the magazine for which my character worked on Ugly Betty? I'm making one up. Duh. I'm gonna say USA Weekly. Mode Magazine. Mode? It was Mode Magazine and I answered the phones. I'd say, Mode Magazine, how can I help you? And then I would just hang up. Ugh, mode. It was a great magazine. <laughs> <laughs> the career of Zach's character Dave on Happy Endings was... Dog Sled Driver. Ha! You wish. Food truck owner. Close. Very close. What happens if nobody wins? <laughs> that means we just don't know anything <laughs> about each other. Who played Becky's love interest on How I Met Your Mother? This is where I take the game. Ready? Neil Patrick, Neil Patrick Harris. Harris. Oh, you're winning. Which horror <laughs> movie remake did Zach star in with Sophia Bush? Ready? Yeah. Friday the 13th, Zach is back. The Hitcher, oh. with a bloody knife. Ooh, you should have given me the bloody knife hint. Then I really would have gotten it. <laughs> what would Becky say is the perfect place for a first date? On the couch, making out. Times Square. Whatever. Close, very close, not far off. Times Square, did you, you, you say you lived in New York City? Nobody goes to Times Square who lives in New York City. If you ride the subway, you do. Zach would say something you should never say on a first date. Did you bring contraception? Oh, that's a good one. I thought Zach would argue against, buy whatever you want. That's actually pretty good. I feel like, <laughs> I feel like you should get a half point for that because... <laughs> I, do I get half a point? Give her half. Okay, good. What would Becky say is the weirdest thing about her? Okay, ready? Go. That she's not weird at all. I bake lasagna to show affection for people. That's the second lasagna reference you made today. This is why I thought you would know it. I was trying to help you out. According to him, the weirdest thing about himself. Can I lie? I'm feeling solid about this one. No, it has to be the truth. Well, now I have to think. Uh, I know I was this. coming up with something funny, and then you just killed my comedy vibing that was happening in my brain. One, two, three. That I don't like to be clean shaven. Does not groom between jobs. I win, I she win, won. I win. Yes! Uh, I mean. I can't believe I gave you a half point for being wrong. Do we need to call it a tie and have a tiebreaker? Just give it to her. I feel like I just won. I won. Just Sorry, give it to her. I won. I won. So generous. I it Normally, generous my competitive of heart spirit is, exactly is not. How I would describe him. Uh, that way, normally, competitor Zach would never no. have done that. I feel like I just killed that. I'm just saying. I feel like I really won that by a landslide. Well, I'm gonna rub that in his face the rest later. of the day. I will. <laughs>